Hey guys, what's up? <clears throat> Wanted to show you a quick update today. It's just going to be a probably five, six minute video just updating the two projects. Definitely going to show some on Jerry. I know it's been a few videos since we've done anything on him, but been focusing on the Camaro, trying to get it done and driving, so we're actually going to be selling that once it's over. Um, but that's why I've been working on that a lot, and that's been why there's most of those videos. But Jerry's got some more work that needs done, but we just haven't done it yet. He's kind of been sitting to the side. Uh, but I will show you some updates that we have gotten done that haven't been on the past videos. So I'll switch over. So I'll go ahead and switch around, and I'll show you some updates on the Camaro first, and we can go over to Jerry. Um, I got the uh, LS and 4L60 mocked in um, first time engine mounts, trans mounts all work and are going to work out good. I kind of painted it red. It's going to be red. Uh, I just painted a little bit of it to see what it's going to look like but I'll paint the rest of it um, once I pull it back out of the car and I'm going to paint the repaint the engine bay and paint some other stuff like suspension black and kind of just repaint some stuff that needs it. Um, but I did want to show you guys I got the wheels or I got the tires mounted on the wheels. I know I showed you the update on the wheels last video but I got the tires now and I went ahead and put them on and it looks pretty sick. The rear end is like enormous. But that's what it's going to look like. You can definitely tell how freaking huge the rear are going to be. But they really don't stick out too bad and past the fenders. They're still pretty much in line with them. So. Working on the interior next of it. I got a new, some new speakers and stereo to put in it and uh, a hole to patch in the floor. Small hole, but still got to take the driver's seat out and fix a hole in the floor and then eventually I'm going to touch up all the black black paint on the car pull a couple of dents that's in it but it's really not that bad buff it out but it's definitely coming along the next step is finish all the suspension change the rear end that we already have and it won't take too long so hopefully in a couple weeks we'll be able to get it running So now the update on Jerry. As you can see, we got the seat in. Um, roll cage is mostly is mostly all done, but the door bars, um, steering column is back in it. Made some body mounts, um, and we're working on stripping all the front fenders and trunk lid to lighten it up and just put the. Uh, doghouse bag on it but the new part that we just got in recently is uh, the new rear end that's going to be going in it uh, Ford 88 that we just pulled out of the junkyard from an Explorer I'm going to mount that in the rear four link. Uh, that's kind of what we're waiting on next. I know Steven's finished up putting the engine together, valve covers, everything, intake. We, he went ahead and wrapped it in plastic to keep all the debris and stuff out of it. But And the transmission's sitting there to get rebuilt. He has everything to rebuild. It just needs to take the time and do it. Um, but yeah, so things are moving along on Jerry too. We just got to get the rear end in and Steven's going to finish the transmission then we can put the drivetrain in it. We can start putting the floor in and then wiring up and get a first test fire. It looks pretty far apart, but it's really not since it's a drag car. Um, most of the left is just body panels, wiring, and install the drivetrain. It's pretty much all there as far as fabrication and everything so 
it looks pretty far apart, but it's really not too bad. It's really not too far. So, like I said, I just wanted to make an update video on both the projects. It's kind of a, it's going to be super short, not much editing or anything, but I wanted to get something else out there. It's hard to find all the time to get worked on, especially on both the cars, but making progress. The Camaro, for me at least, is the main priority. I'm trying to get it done and sold so like we can move on to the next project so but yeah looks looking good so far I think alright guys well I'm gonna go ahead and end it there I know it's a quick short update video just on the Camaro and Jerry haven't gotten a lot, lot done. Like I said, I've been focusing on the Camaro myself, and Steven hasn't had time to get a whole lot of work done. And I know it's pretty boring video. I know they haven't been too exciting yet because we're just kind of working on the cars and making little progress at a time. But when the Camaro's finished, it'll be a lot more exciting than we've gotten out. And hopefully, Jerry gets running anytime soon would be great. It's not too far away, but it's hard to find the time to get it all done but we're really trying um but like i said we're real close from um, getting two cars running that should be pretty awesome we'll do some pretty cool stuff with it once that happens but right now we're just kind of pushing through some hard work boring to film work which i know some of the stuff i've done on camaro has been so boring that it wasn't even worth filming but i'm gonna do the suspension um and i'll film some of that kind of go through some of that but definitely when we're close to getting it running will be a another video on Jerry's rear end is going to get done soon and then the next thing it's just going to be putting the drivetrain in and we'll fire it up so better content's coming but we're just kind of pushing through this boring stuff I know but two projects together it's hard to find the time to get both done especially as quickly as we want to get them done but like I said I want to put this update video out there just to kind of show you we actually are working but all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like, and uh, we'll see you next time.